40 days of Lent. As we begin our day, let us stop and reflect as we journey to Resurrection Sunday. Today's topic, a private preview. Meditation scripture, Mark chapter 9, verses 9 through 13. I had the privilege of attending a few private screenings in my lifetime, and it is an extraordinary experience. As a first-time attendee, it is easy for you to become wild with a special screening encounter. You will sometimes meet the cast for the latest blockbuster in a private auditorium with guaranteed seating and no waiting in lines. If the content is relatively good, you will leave spellbound, telling everyone of your experiences and encouraging them to see it themselves. Please understand that there was a purpose for your invitation. You were invited to create a buzz about what you saw so the community you influence will feel the same. This is very different from what we experience in our biblical text for this moment. Jesus is the host and cast members to this extraordinary private preview that featured Moses and Elijah conversing with the Son of God. I can only imagine that what the disciples saw sparked them to share it with their families. However, after the heavenly encounter was over, Jesus gave clear instructions not to tell anyone until the resurrection. Here it is. The disciples are paralyzed with the amazement of what just happened. But Jesus placed them on mute until the miracle of resurrection. They question, what does this mean? And when should it happen? These are great questions, but the disciples gave the wrong attention. Jesus said something very striking in the midst of it all. In verse 12 and 13, Jesus effectively portrayed Elijah in the form of John the Baptist, and he was mistreated and killed. What should take place on the mountain in the private preview was not about Elijah or Moses, but the suffering of Jesus. This insight suggests that we were invited to this private preview with the intention not to carry a message, but a cross. If you can endure the pain, then you can receive the promise, blessings. Let us pray. God of life, empower me to share the message of Christ and him crucified. In the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. This meditation and prayer was submitted by Charlie Haynes, Jr.